According to a Financial Times study in 2012, over 90% of businesses fail within the first five years, whereas with an established network, 92% of businesses succeed. So there's a massive gap there between obviously failure and success. And the main thing that what we're about is, is because we can concentrate on helping you run the business and show you how to run the business, we're not concentrating the majority of our time teaching you a job that you've already done for 30 years. Lawnmaster allows the franchisees to create gross recurring revenue, to, uh, to build a block of business to start off with that you can take here and know that every year that comes back and comes back and comes back. The more I looked into certainly what Matt was doing and Kevin Unsworth, who does the Hampshire area, I thought, well, if I was, had a nice house and a nice lawn, would I want someone who had just passed a qualification, as in a spraying qualification, and it was just a, a banker or a baker last week and was now selling me a lawn um, maintenance package? Or would I want someone that's been a greenkeeper or a groundsman for X number of years looking after it? And the obvious answer is, well, I'd want a greenkeeper or a groundsman who actually knows what the different fertilizers and different chemicals would do. And the more I thought about it and looked into the whole package, it became quite obvious that there was a whole market up there that is hardly tapped for professional greenkeepers and groundsmen to offer their expertise to the public. We've got the software supplied to run the business, um, which has been a, a real asset to us. We wouldn't be able to, <coughs> to, to do as much work as we do without this uh, software backup. Yes, I know about grass. Yes, I know what I'm doing with grass, you know, um, and, and the general aspects of maintaining a good lawn. Um, but business side of things, you know, and we've got good support from Bob and Rachel and, 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 and you know, and accountants and stuff. And you don't realise it until you're in business, but an accountant is worth his weight in gold. I've been head office a few times and it's just, um, we were given a lot of contacts, a lot of phone numbers, other depots and the help and support you get off those more established businesses, the guys what have been up for two or three years longer than me. Um, yeah, so initial first stage when you get running the business is nerve-wracking, taking on your first customer, first quotes, and uh, once you get the ball rolling it seems to just lead on to more and more. But in the golf club environment you might know the greenkeepers or groundsmen at the next golf club or the next football club, but probably outside that you don't know what the guys are doing in Scotland or down in Cornwall or somewhere. Here I have access to a forum where we can swap ideas, which is 24-7. I've spoken to Bob on a Sunday evening with a few problems and issues, and he's got back to me and Matt, his son's, come on the computer and sorted things out. The gardening industry as a whole in the UK is, is worth eight billion. The lawn care industry side of that is estimated at just over half a billion pounds. It continues to grow and Lawnmaster continues to grow by a significant amount every year. You've got to look at the earning capacity of this. A lot of these guys earn more money in a day than you earn in a week with this. And a single vehicle operation is capable of turning over in excess of £15,000 a month with one van with you and one van. That's a massive, massive difference when you're, you know, when you're looking at paying the loan back for £23,500. I earn more money and um, work less hours. It's as simple as that. Um, I've spent probably two months of this year on the golf course, <laughs> playing golf while my staff are out working. Um, having said that, my support is still there for my staff and um, my support is still there for my customers' lungs. You know, if there's a problem, we're, we're, we're on top of it straight away. But yeah, with regards to my life and quality of life, I, I couldn't be happier. The franchise package includes everything they need basically to run this business um, and that starts with all the tools, the equipment. We supply enough product to service the first £9,000 worth of revenue that they've got. I'll give you an example, one of the machines alone and the marketing fund that we've got is, is nearly £10,000 of the fee that we charge. 
we've got uniforms, we've got livery, but the, possibly the most and the biggest um, investment that we've got, that, that we give, is the software. And over um, the last 10 years, we've invested over £100,000 in software. And even to date, today, we are still going through an upgrade which is costing in excess of £30,000 to move the software onto tablets uh, to make the job easier and make the job um, more attractive, less hours doing paperwork and more time doing the job and doing the job that they, that they love. Don't hesitate. I, I, I wrote an article a few weeks ago that's going to appear in an IOG magazine. Um, and I ended it by saying, have a look around your own workplace, whether it's a football club or a golf club or a rugby club, and be honest with yourself. Are you going to get that promotion that you're after or you think you deserve? With that promotion, are you going to get a pay rise? Are things fundamentally going to change? Are you going to get a new piece of kit that's going to be the wonder of everything? That's going to, are you going to get new facilities? If your answer to all of that is yes, stay where you are and give it a try. If you're going, well, actually, no, honestly, I don't think I'm going to get promotion. I don't think I'm going to get a pay rise. I don't think I'm going to be respected any more in five years' time than I am now. Then try and find something else. Because if you keep doing the same things, guess what? The same things will keep happening. If you're in self-employed or you own your own business, there are so many opportunities to gain substantial rewards and shield it from taxation. If you're an employee, you have to earn automatically 53% more to get the same result than you do if you're self-employed or own your own company. So many things can, are business expenses that are not allowable when you're actually in employment. Follow the Lawnmaster systems, make the most of the taxation system and go for it. After I paid my fees I remember sitting in um, Bob's office after training and all of a sudden going what if this don't work? And Bob just said it will work. And yeah, he was right. <laughs> it's really odd, but he, um, you know, he, um, he, he knows, he, he knows it, it just doesn't fail, that, you know, he, he'll only take on the right people. If you're in doubt at all, looking at things, pick the phone up, come out on the van with anybody who does Lawn Master, sit with us next to us, chat with our customers, ask them the same questions, and then your eyes will be opened to what actually can be achieved.